All right. Uh, hello, welcome to the stream. Um, I see some people are already there. That's lovely. The Twitch app tells me zero people are watching, but two people are in the chat. So uh, that's how numbers work, I guess. Yeah, I don't have any specific ideas for what I'm going to do uh, today. Just do random stuff unless someone requests more specific stuff, I guess. Um, and then in the end probably upload it to YouTube. I don't know, maybe even upload some of it to comments. I don't know. Uh, I'm not sure if that was, if I'm happy with this recording. Uh, we'll see. Um, I'll just look for something else to play in here. Uh, no, no, not that one. That's this. which is uh, tricky to do and I've never really played it and it's also long as hell apparently um, which I don't feel like right now um, also my fingers are a bit cold I I think I should close the window uh, and turn this up just a little bit uh, also I got a DM on Twitter is that relevant to the stream? no not at all okay um, yeah, if anyone doesn't have a Twitch account, you can also write me suggestions on Telegram or Twitter or something else. Um, uh, yeah, let's, actually this one is neat. Um, I won't be able to do this quite justice, but it's a nice little uh, piece. It's the Invitation to the Dance, uh, with which starts with the uh, uh, two dancers kind of getting to know each other in the introduction, then there's a bunch of dances, and then in the end they kind of uh, go apart again. And it's just kind of neat, so let's try to play that. The Invitation to the Dance by Karl Maria von Weber. Thank you. 
Okay, that was the invitation to the dance by Karl Maria von Weber, and I think we might as well continue with uh, this next piece because that's also nice. Impromptu by Franz Schubert, and it doesn't have anything else, no opus number or anything. It's in A flat major. Sure.
All right. Uh, um, let's do something else next and put this away and maybe pick up some uh, Scott Joplin. I don't know. Um, Binks as waltz. No, that's not very exciting. Uh, no, I can't play Leola very well. Rosebud March. Bethina. I think I played that for one of my first streams or something. Um, let's do that again. Bethina, a concert waltz by Scott Joplin, because he did not just write Ragtime, so this is a concert waltz, Bethina.
Right, that was Bethina. Um, let's try the Psychomore next. I don't know. John Scott, uh, Scott Joplin, the Psychomore. with that one didn't go so well uh, let's try one more Scott Joplin and then go on to a different one maple leaf rag nah. not right now maybe the um, what's it called gladiolus rag instead that's somewhere in the back I believe uh, where is the gladiolus Or I could just play it from memory. Gladiolus. No, wait, there's no index in the beginning, is there? No, there is. Uh, da -da. Gladiolus, page 157. And it's called a table of contents, not an index. Uh, there we go. Okay. So, Gladiolus rag, also Scott Joplin.
Not perfect, but good enough. Uh, need to practice more, apparently. Uh, let's try something else. Uh, if anyone has suggestions or requests, uh, feel free to leave them in the chat. Um, otherwise... Uh, no, no, neither of these two right now. Uh, I think I need a little break for my hands and try to find something uh, simpler. Uh, just something from the real book. How about that? Some... Uh, Bessie's Blues? Uh, a Beatles song, I but I can't sing that at the same time, so I'm not sure how that would work. Uh, I also just realized that so far I think this has been a stream just with public domain compositions, and maybe I just want to keep it that way and then I can put it on YouTube hopefully without any problems and just set the license of the whole video to Creative Commons, so maybe I don't want to pick anything from the real book. Um, let's try that. Uh, let's look for something simple. Uh, 
Maybe I'll try to find something. All right, I think there was something from Brahms. I think it's somewhere in here as well. A cradle song, if I'm not mistaken, or something like that. No, an intermezzo, 61. Is that the one? Yep, that's the one. An intermezzo uh, with some kind of uh, sleeping cradle song above it in German, but supposed to be Scottish, so presumably translated. Not sure if that poem is was added to the piece by Brahms or by the editor of this uh, edition here. No idea. Uh, anyway, some intermezzo by Brahms in uh, E flat major that was, um, which is quite a nice one. Uh, let's yeah, let's try to find something else.
I got a suggestion. Oh, when the saints. I'm not sure if that's public domain. Uh, depends on who wrote it and if they died 70 years ago, I guess. If anyone wants to check if oh, when the saints is public domain or not on Wikipedia or something. Uh, if it is, I can play it. But I don't know. Uh, yeah. Promenade from Pictures of an Exhibition. Uh, and the one before that was just improvised, if anyone's wondering. Uh, I could go for one of those now, I think. Uh, so the option we have is something from from Liszt, from the Years of Pilgrimage, or the Rhapsody in Blue. I think I could go for either one. If anyone has preferences in the chat uh, right now, like in the next 30 seconds or so, which is not very much time with stream delay, but um, let me know. Um, and otherwise, I... Uh, in blue. Okay. I was slightly leaning towards that, I think, so... Very nice. Okay. Rhapsody in Blue it is, which entered the public domain this or last year, I believe. And this arrangement here says copyright, copyright 2010. Uh, but I looked it up on this International Music Score Library Project, whatever it's called. Uh, and this is actually one from Gershwin himself. Um, it's What I have here is almost identical to the PDF I found there, except for a few lines so i think this has to be this arrangement is public domain as well which means i can play it which is nice so here is george gershwin rhapsody in blue
Would you believe that the battery of my headphones ran out right here? Uh, so uh, the end of that is going to have sounded much better for you than for me because I had to turn off the headphones and had no noise cancelling and much quieter volume and just all the sounds from me hitting the keys. Yay! Okay. Uh, and with that, I think I am done. I mean, I have uh, spare batteries somewhere, but I think um, I'm just going to call it an evening. Um, so yeah, thank you all uh, for joining me. It was very nice. I hope it was nice for you as well. And see you next time, whenever the next time is, I guess. Bye.